What up, y'all? Making this video on a touchy topic, man. Japan's nuclear accident forced thousands of people to flee their homes and live elsewhere. The country's leaders want to make it possible for them to go back. I don't really understand y'all, you know what I mean? To do that, they're going to reclassify some areas in the evacuation zone around Fukushima Daiichi. I don't really get it. Places with relatively low radiation will be redesignated as preparation zones so residents can return home as soon as possible. What the fuck's wrong with you, like? What, I mean... The evacuation zone around Fukushima Daiichi is 20 kilometers. Residents left the area in mid-March. The town of Naraha is the first among 11 municipalities within the no-go zone to get a cleanup. I just don't get ya. Workers are focusing on roads and public facilities that are vital for daily life. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? They're using power washers to decontaminate what they can. They say this can reduce radioactivity by about 80%. Why can't you just be fucking cool because there's something fucking wrong with you? I don't like to say oh yeah, but... Oh yeah, motherfuckers, man! In the town of Tomioka, workers checked radiation levels along the closed section of the Jobang Expressway ahead of decontamination operations. We should face the fact that the procedure will be slow. Man, you barely need a cool one, man. But we have to speed things up so troubled residents can return home as soon as possible. Wait, um, like, what the fuck? But it is feared any homecoming is still a long way off. Damn. You must have a low fucking frequency you elevate. I don't know how the fuck y'all function. Decontaminating private homes may even take until this summer to start. The job requires the permission of each homeowner. Man, what the fuck, man? And there are ongoing challenges restoring water and electricity as many lifelines remain seriously damaged from the earthquake and tsunami. It's just amazing, man. The mayor of a town near the crippled Fukushima Daiichi is sick of waiting on Tokyo Electric Power Company and he's handled the utility of bill for compensation. Futaba Town's demand for over $200 million makes it the first municipality near the plant to make such a claim. Barely, like, ah, uh, it's red in the motherfucker, man. Town Mayor Katsutaka Idogawa handed the invoice to a senior TEPCO official on Thursday at a makeshift town hall inside an evacuation center some 200 kilometers southwest of the township. Futaba is charging about $211 million in compensation for buildings and property. I mean, that's why they call you out of fucking devil. Y'all do evil shit. Like, what the fuck is wrong with y'all motherfuckers, man? The township was forced to move after it was designated a no-entry zone. The TEPCO official told the mayor the company will consider the matter promptly, along with compensation claims by individuals. But he offered no time frame for a reply. But you motherfuckers, every time we get around y'all, bunch of y'all motherfuckers, man, y'all gotta make the slick comments. To the amount we are asking now is only for a portion of the damage. We are suffering unlimited damage from the accident. Anybody out there decides to watch this shit, I, I want to know what the fuck. Mayor Itogawa said the town will invoice TEPCO for its evacuation costs later. <laughs> like, when we, when we set in on y'all, we will really get you, and then y'all be all crunchy faced up, and I don't get it, man. It has been almost a year since the nuclear accident at the Fukushima Daiichi power plant. Only two of Japan's 54 nuclear reactors are currently running, but even these are to be shut down by late April. An NHK survey has found that nearly 80% of the municipalities that host or are near nuclear power plants are wary about resuming operations at those reactors that are offline for regular inspections. Well, I mean... We don't give a fuck about you. Why do you care so much about us, man? 
The survey covered 20 prefectures along with 122 cities, towns and villages outside Fukushima Prefecture. Each municipality is within 30 kilometers of a nuclear power plant. What the fuck is wrong with you? 14% said they would now or eventually give the go-ahead for resuming reactor operations. But 75% said they would not allow a resumption for the time being or could not yet decide. And 4% said they would never allow a resumption. The municipalities expressed concerns about the effectiveness of safety measures at the reactors and complained that the central government is not doing what it should. There's something fucking wrong. I don't like to say oh yeah, but... Oh, y'all motherfuckers, man! We also asked about what's important when deciding whether to restart the reactors. 63% replied a satisfactory investigation into the accident at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. 59% cited understanding by local residents, and 58% said new safety regulations. Only 17% cited stress testing, which the government views as a prerequisite for deciding whether to resume reactor operations. Man, you barely meet a cool one, man.